Hey, what's going on, guys? It's me, Train Man, and there was an update since the last time we played. And it's actually going to make things interesting, and I'm not sure how this is going to work out. So, in the most recent patch, they added a couple of things, one of which is the ability to do this, I think. Yeah. The ability to do that. Uh, although there's a signal in the way this time. But now we have double crosses. The other big change is the one I don't like, and that is road vehicles, when you purchase them, and probably uh, train vehicles as well. When you purchase them, they are bound to a certain kind of thing. So, for example, this is goods only, although, hold on, what is this? I don't know what half these buttons are. Hold on, I'm, I don't know how this works at all. Select vehicle, sell, set line, clone vehicle, sell vehicle. Oh, so they made this a little bit nicer. But they made it so that when you buy a thing, also there's a sorting system. Refit, oh yeah, that's what I mean. They can carry either iron ore or coal. This is a problem, not so much in train lines, because I haven't done it too much in train lines, but in some vehicle, in some truck lines where I have... Let's see, let's, let's do an example here. This is not an example. Where is a good example? There is a good example around here, I think. And it's because I had trucks that are doing two things, I think. Did I do that here? Did I do that here? Uh, I don't, I can't actually recall now. I, no, I didn't. I, I don't think there are too many... Man, the whistle's getting blown all day today. I don't think there are too many places where this is actually relevant, but we will have to keep an eye out for uh, situations where this system is no longer valid. And I'm not sure what happens to trucks that currently are doing this. So... I assume you just dropped something off. Um, yeah, you guys you guys look like you're ready for all at this point still. And we'll see how this pans out. Um, yeah, we have this up here. I assume this guy's gonna pick up goods like a normal truck. Or he's just gonna drive through and come out the other side, but I hope it's the first one. Yep. So he's pulling in there, and he's going to load goods. Alright, and nothing's actually shown in the back there, probably because it's automatically assuming they're fitted for coal. I don't know, that's a little bit confusing. Something's wrong with the, the sprites there because of, well, because we migrated this game into a more recent version. So that's a little bit odd. Anyways, what were we doing last time? We were working on something oil-related? Question mark. You're going awfully slow. Oh, this is a hell of a hill, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I just did this road, didn't I? Did I? I feel like I would've. No, these roads are newly redone by the city, I think. Oh, so great. Now they're upgrading their own roads. Damn it, that's not convenient at all. Alright. However, I do need to upgrade these roads. Because we're going to be using them, I think. No, we're not. No, we're not. No, we're not. Here, we've got to have these trucks running. We've got to start these guys running. Let's see. Actually, are we still losing money? We're making money right now. Last year we lost 11 million dollars um, because we spent all that money on vehicles. Okay, that's right. Uh, has the other place seen profit from this yet? How are you guys doing? You think I think you guys could use another vehicle? Uh, let me see. Or maybe not, because you have zero out of ten passengers. Three out of ten. One out of ten. 
one out of ten. No, it's not so good. Uh, Army of Horus probably needs replacing. Let's see. What is this place? Oh, it's Scarborough. This place could definitely use an upgrade, because Scarborough has grown very rapidly since the last time. Although, wait, Scarborough's got... No, 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 no. I don't know, I think I'm just going to replace the vehicles for the Line 15 here. So I'm going to sell these guys. Where's our vehicle depot? No, really, where is it? Where'd I put it? Oh, it's over here. I'm going to get five of them, and I'm going to set them loose on Line 15. There we are. Be free. Uh, hopefully that will improve service more or less. It looks like the the way things are set up right now, it's actually a little bit wonky. So I wouldn't be too amazed, but I trust in my former self to have done that sensibly. Maybe I shouldn't. Where's the train that's supposed to do this? Oh, that's right. There is no train that's supposed to do this. Because... the crossover. Crossover is there. There is no train that's supposed to do this because Scarborough is right now receiving goods from like all over the place. I wonder if I should remove the train that's doing it and just let it get taken over by a different place because obviously the desire is there for something else to be doing it. Like, you know, we've got goods shuffling in from here and from here, so, I don't know, although we probably won't have goods shuffling in from here now, uh, maybe this is a good thing. No pun intended, it just might be better that the trucks can no longer take stuff down this way, although they can right now because they haven't been refitted yet. They're right now universal trucks, kind of, you know, like real life. Oh, here's one of those examples. We're gonna be have to we're gonna have to be kind of careful when we upgrade this, I think, because this is carrying. Oh, uh, ignore that, please. This is carrying stuff to and fro, back and forth. So that's a problem that needs to be rectified, uh, unless we just keep these guys in service forever, or unless we divide the workforce in half, which is not. Uh, realistic or efficient at all. I'm honestly not sure which one I'd pick at this point. Alright, let's look at other routes that are losing money. Again, we'll, we're gonna look more he more heavily at the train routes. For example, line 16. What line are you? Oh, you're this one. Oh, okay. You can see why you'd be in a little bit of trouble here. Especially with that pretty arduous stretch of single track you've got right here, uh, which I'd like to fix, but I'm not sure how good of an idea it is. Actually, that's not a lot of single track. Although, I could use my first double cross, so let's do that. We'll put this like so. Oh, I thought you said I could upgrade... Oh, I could upgrade track without a train being on it, but I can't change it, of course. I wouldn't honestly expect that anyways. I was going to be pleasantly surprised if it worked. And so let's let this guy get out of the way, and then we're going to go ahead and uh, build, some, build some more track in here. Although, what might be effective is... Hey, get out the way. What is that considered the same such same blah, blah, blah. same stretch of track? I have to signal this right though. Oh come on, you're out of the way. Unless you're just gonna give me that error all day. Maybe that's a new bug. Oh, let's try it again. 
drive from here. Where? I don't think that's the same stretch of track, so... Where is there a vehicle in the way? Oh, there you go. Alright. We've got to do some clever signaling here. First one goes there. Second and third ones go here and here. And fourth one goes here. That actually ought to work better than the setup we currently have. Except for the freight train. The freight train could get in trouble doing that. Which is why I only left one uh, crossover there, because I don't want to send him over and then back over. Alright, so this, this is running out of money. Oh, there's a general in here. We've only got this, or this. I'm not so keen on using this guy for passenger service. Although we could use these. So, these go 100. This goes... I mean, this has the power, this has the speed. This doesn't have a lot of power, but it's very light. Um, I think it's mellow before I see him. 18, these guys carry... 18 passengers, 18 passengers. We could, we could stick a bunch of these guys back to back, but... How expensive are these guys compared to... Well, the Hiawathas are pretty expensive. Let's see, how many passengers are these carrying? Ninety-six. And they currently carry seventy-two. Well, let's think. If we do, because... What, what I was thinking is if we had maybe four of them to increase frequency and, you know, sort of have an intermediary. Hold on. You know what? Let's just try it. Let's try it. Uh, how much are these guys compared to... They're much less expensive. So, two, three, four. Oh, you can't put them next to one another, can you? Crap. Oh, wait. Yes, you can. I wish I could turn it around. Could I slap passenger cars on one? I'm not sure if that's viable. I don't know. I mean, this is this is definitely an option. I figured one of them would flip around so we have like I don't know. They carry 72 passengers. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this multiple times over. This is an experimentally bad idea. But we're gonna try it. ends here, so... Although it looks like three is pretty much all this... You know, all this place is gonna get... These guys are gonna go a lot... Oops, I bought one too many. Alright. Oh, that's right, because this guy goes through the station track there. That was an executive decision. Maybe not a good one, but it was, it was one. Alright. So, you guys, we're going to try and sell you three. This guy is not getting a path to stop, apparently. I think I know where he is, too. Alright, set line, line 16. First time these guys are coming out of the box, let's see what they look like. Man, they, found, they sound weird. All right, well. <laughs> Is this you? No, it's not you. This guy's on single track. 
So then I'm pretty sure I know exactly where he is. Alright, you, be free. Learned something new about the game last time. Oh, you're coming into the station there. Alright, well, uh, once you turn around, I'm going to send you to depot. And then I'll let this guy come out. Just wait until this guy turns around. Heading for depot. Alright, get in there. All those people waiting at the crossing. What an uncivilized sort. No grade separation. What have I done? Alright, set line. Oops, and that's no longer tied to a train, is it? So now we've got two things in that depot. We'll see what these guys, this thing does. All right, get out of here. They've got pretty good acceleration. Hope they can handle themselves up the hill. This guy is driving to his death. This guy is trailing right behind him. Oh, this guy's charging up the hill. Look at him. He's going up the hill at 100. I should have stuck some coaches in the middle there. That would have looked weird, but they look weird enough. I think we could have gotten away with it. Alright, hopefully these guys will turn a profit. Alright, let's turn our mind to some other systems. You guys are almost running out of money. Uh, or you guys are almost making a profit, I should say. Oh, that's because you're line 18 and, and there are, there's trouble in paradise for you guys. I think maybe I should do the same thing with the rail buses with you guys. Certainly make things interesting. But these guys are only just losing money, so I'm not sure if I'm willing to invest that much. These four lines need immediately immediate replacement or update. And I'm going to do them one by one, because maybe they just sort of need... What's the word? They need some tender love and care. Now, what they need is they need... Some of them need new stops. Like, I think I'm going to route around King Street. Am I? Should I? Yeah, I'll, I'll put a new stop over here and route to that place instead of King Street. Hold on, we need to stop. Right, oh, wrong side of the road. The rest of them should be okay, but they're kind of close together. Right, so instead of King Street, I want to add a station right there. Called New Street, of course. Alright, so this one is that pink line, so I'm gonna send you guys to depot. I go over to the depot, buy some road vehicles. One, two, three, four. Because this place isn't that big, so four buses should do it. And set line all to this place. Alright, up next, line 19. A nearby town of Reading, or Reading, but probably Reading. This, the Department of Superfluous Roads does not like this at all. And that's marginally better. Not enough space for me to demolish it? How is there not enough space? Alright, well... There was enough space. Okay, so that was a waste of money, but... I gotta kill some things. I gotta destroy a building, so... All's well that ends well, for me.
Okay, so send these guys away. With a quick adjustment of the town, I'm pretty sure this place is okay with the route it still has. So we're just going to get four more vehicles and set them out to be on Route 20. Or 19. 19, that's what this is. Oh, whoops. Hold on. Route 19. Yep. Alright. This place is probably fine. The, the, it could be moved to a little bit more of the outskirts, but what the hell did you guys do here? That's better. Unfortunately, I can only be the Department of Superfluous Roads if I have a lot of money. And right now we're losing money, so maybe I shouldn't do that. Alright, so anyways, I've got to send these vehicles to the can. Uh, where is my road depot? It's over there. It's like I'm, I'm, putting it, I'm putting them in such obscure locations, at least I remember where they are. Lime green line. That should be all right. Uh, I could move George Street out. Actually, that's what I'll do. Let's, if I'm going to make one change here, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to move George Street. I'm going to move that station to over here so that we get a little bit more of the outskirts. So let me edit this. Oh, I already have it open. Let me edit this route. Take George Street, remove it, and tell them to go over here. And, oops. Tell them to go over here instead. Yeah, that'll work. Alright. And last but not least, line 21. Okay. This place is huge now. Uh, Northampton has grown tremendously since we were last here, so I'm gonna add a bunch of new stops and try to totally rejuvenate this system, maybe with, you know, probably many more buses than we currently have. So, at the very least, we need to stop on this side of town. We have a stop over there. We have a stop over there, a stop over there. Maybe I overstated a little bit, because I think the stops that we have are more or less okay, now that I have a stop over here. Although I might want to get some more dough out of it, and tell them to put a stop over here as well. I think. Maybe ignore this stop. Although, that's right by the train station. No, but they're definitely going to have to ignore that stop. Unless I have them do this. Which could work. But that means this stop is on the wrong side of the street. Alright, let me adjust... Let me adjust course on this, then. Oh, and this stop is on the wrong side of the street. And so is this one. God damn. I forgot what country I'm in all of a sudden. God damn it, this is America, the greatest country ever. America. Alright, no, but we've got to redo this, this system here. Wait a minute. Line 2. Did I not give you any vehicles? Did I not assign your guys to... They're leaving. They're driving somewhere else. Oh. No, 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 guys. Other lime green colored line. That was my mistake. It's like I, I just had to go and look for the parade of vehicles bound for another town. That's an interesting happenstance. All right, get out of here. Or get, get, not get out of here, but get back over there. Where were we now? Now I'm lost. Where the heck were we? We were doing, oh, we were doing line 21. Take me over there. Take me back. Oh, that line's already making money. Maybe there's hope in the skunks yet. Alright. Alright, I'm going to remove everything from... Remove everything from this. I'm going to add a station starting with this, to here, to here, to here, to here, to here. 
and that, hopefully, will do the trick. Although I don't know. Well, I'm, I may omit North Street, or I may omit High Street if things aren't working so well, but... For now, I think we're going to be alright. Now I need to send these guys to the depot and sell them. Six of them because this place is fairly large. Excuse me, fairly large now. And that is the correct line, I promise. All right. What else? What else is losing money? This is maintenance mode, is what this is. You're losing money still, aren't you? Whoops. And I misclicked. 50 passengers. Not enough to do good. 22 passengers. 26 passengers. Whoops. No, no, no. I want to scroll over. Unloading. How many do you load up? This is Haywood, the end of the line. 50 passengers, almost. Oh, hey, these guys are making money. Uh, no, they're not. Oh, damn it. Alright, three more horse lines that need to be dealt with. It's amazing seeing how these cities have grown, though. This is the time for replacement. Uh, this place has not grown. <laughs> I'd like to point that out immediately. It occurs to me this place is uh, very, very similar to how we left it. This place is still rocking horse carts, though. This must have been an early development of mine. I don't even remember it. All right, line 26. We're going to have to um, sell your stuff. Five, I guess. Because the, the city's a decent size. Okay, and next. Uh, once again, a city that hasn't grown too, too much. Uh, the, the stations could probably be positioned a little bit better. Like, I can move Kingsway out. I'm not sure if I really want to, because then I'd be voiding access for these guys. Because I'm not sure how far people want to walk. We'll just get four of them for now, and take the ones that we're working with, which are these mustard guys, sell them, and set this to the mustard line, and last but not least, line 25. Oh, we were just looking in Haywood. Not huge changes once again. I think I did change the layout here once. But, we're gonna have to sell these guys, and we'll probably only go with a five-vehicle fleet at most, maybe even four. No, I'll go with five. Alright, set line, fill these things in. Which one is this? Twenty-five. Alright now. These guys are heading out, those guys are heading in. It's like... It's like a new era, except not terrible. Unless you really like horses, in which case... I guess it's not so great. But these guys fit in the station, thank god. You've got 21 passengers, that's like nothing. Although you did just make what the maintenance was back in triplicate, that's probably not enough. Oh, whoops, I was looking on the wrong section. I was like, wait, where is this going? 
you get 47, and that other guy's kind of right behind you, so that's not... That's not really ideal. It could be way better. Although, that's probably going to sort that out. That very large single track section. I see trains waiting, and that's not necessarily a bad thing, especially when the problem in a lot of cases is them just being too close together. Yeah, we've got one that's way down to the other end of nowhere, isn't it? Yeah. I'm guessing you've got, like, a full load or something close to. Yeah. Because you're separate from the other ones, the other ones are competing with one another, and this guy's just off on his own. There's nobody even near that station right there. Oh, this guy's hauling, though. Look at him. Oh, no, he's slowing down. Because this guy's not going fast enough. Come on. You can do it. Lay on the speed. Lay on the speed. I could double track this here. Although this guy has to wait, right? Like, you're gonna wait there for a while? Yeah, you're gonna wait for a long while. Good. Good. Do that. It's it's something that would be micromanaged, but I don't know how to micromanage it. It's just kind of a pain. Alright, well, you know what? Let's check on our finances one more time. We've got these guys losing money at a rapid pace. We got line 32, which isn't, you know, these guys with consolidations, they need updating. And we're going to have to move to electricity or diesel sometime soon, although a lot of these guys, it really isn't justified for me to spend all that money up, spend, you know, yeah, spend all that money upgrading them. So I think we're going to get these rail cars just about everywhere. Look at them. They're doing spectacular. Anyways, I guess that means next time on Train Fever. Rail car frenzy. <laughs> we'll see, because these guys, probably. These guys, probably. These guys, you know, most of these lines that are still on consolidations, you know, obviously all the trains are outdated and they haven't come to my attention enough to make me upgrade them yet. So, well, it's going to be difficult for me to justify electricity, like I said, especially when this guy, our only electric train, is losing so much money. And, I mean, if I put double on there, it'd put that in half, but honestly, am I going to make it lose twice as much? He does what he needs to do. Oh, no, he doesn't. He's going... He's going towards what ought to be the goods outlet with no goods. Well, that's a problem. Yeah, no, you're coming from the goods station. Where are all your goods? I'm guessing it's because the travel time is too long, so... I mean, I, I would figure. I put this in there so that he'd be fast. But apparently it's not fast enough. Well, I don't know what to do for him now. Maybe we could try and get goods in from somewhere else. Maybe, like, over here, which is apparently going ham with goods on its own. Look at it. Are you... How are you doing in terms of... Oops. No, 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 no. 26 out of 60 for, you know, something that's running by itself. By itself? Not so bad. We'll look into that maybe next time, maybe the time after that. We've still got some more goods to deliver more cities that need them. And I will see you next week. Trayman out. Thank you.